Who got this dog out? Did you? Did you get her out? I got her out. Okay, so how was she on the kettle approach? She's fine. Not, not fine is not an option. Non-reactive. Calm, friendly manner. Relaxed, friendly. Indifferent, aloof. Okay, next. Touch handling. Okay, watch the way you handle your leash, right? Good. And as much as possible, it's not a livestock exam. It's kind of like, you know, you want to be, you know, be cool with the dog. Just pet her a little bit. Make it like part, yeah, it's part of the game. It's like, oh, good girl. Hey, good girl. You know, I'm going to pet her ears. I'm going to cover her eyes. I'm going to handle her mouth. It's, it's affectionate. You know, it's not as sterile as all the other stuff. You don't have to ever sit. Keep going. This, this is somewhere where I would try to figure out why she's so nutty when I put my hands underneath there. When you guys did it. Right. Okay. So she's got some, hi some hind quarter issues, right? So why is she doing that? I want to see that. Right? Right. So she might have some hip issues or something. And again, hold that just for a second. When I touch her hind quarter to see why she's doing this, first I'm going to give her a treat, right? I'm going to take the leash, and I'm going to go here, and I'm going to try to get to this hind quarter. See how I have the leash here? Right, she flanked her. She, did, she got into this position here. But again, she's still not doing it as much here. And a lot of it has to do with being really calm. Don't try to rush through it. You know what I mean? So I have to figure out how to say that. You know, um, dog moves away in a neutral manner. Um, dog kind of accepts it, but doesn't accept additional. Um, but more importantly, I'd say the dog gets avoidant at some of the spots, but I'm going to have to say that. So I'm going to say, when handled on hind quarters, dog sometimes gets avoidant, period. Otherwise, dog is relatively neutral. OK. OK, done. Touch handling. Next, possession test. Let's see if how she is with the with with possession. And as much as possible, follow along on the sheet, because the sheet is exactly what this is, and what's, what you're going to have on the app as soon as you get the app. So she doesn't really have any interest in toys. I'm not seeing her really engaging on a toy. Yeah. I feel this dog doesn't know how to play with a toy, period. Next. Okay, so food. 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 Yeah. <laughs> you guys owe me. No pouches, no food. All right, let's see her with the food. Let us bring it across uh, customs. That's Mike's. All right, well, next time stop at Costco. <laughs> or have a pouch and you can load up here. All right, so go ahead. So let's go with the food. Offer the food. Take the food away. Good. Tease her a little. There you go. Good. And then let her have it. And next you're going to take that big piece, that whole piece. You're going to show it to her and you're going to cover it with your foot. And I pray to God she doesn't go after your foot. All right. Okay. So this dog is indifferent and friendly with food engagement, and he gets confused when food is removed or covered. She is completely confused. She doesn't know what's going on, right? So what if the dog's like scratching at your foot to get to the food? That's the next option. Dog's assertive to get to the food, pushes hands or, or digs at foot to get treat. Doesn't mean anything. It's just that one dog was food motivated, you know? I'm looking for a dog that's going to go and try to bite your foot. And that's why you... Huh? Try to get it at all costs. At all costs, yeah. If he's interested, it's good. Yo, I don't want to get bit, yeah. Yeah, I would say, hey, knock it off. And I would take him away and give him another piece of food, yeah. So, next, correction test. This is going to be easy. She's going to be real skittish. Yeah, and no, no. Yeah. 
So the reason I say that is because, uh, you know, some people will tend to say, Shh, or, hey, read, well, the common thing if a dog does something wrong, we're going to go, no, don't do that. No, correction. Right. And that should be a firm correction. Right, good. Okay. So dog redirects very easily, becomes compliant. Um, I would say dog is also very indifferent to engaging with the handler, period. Done. Next. Dominance test. Push down on her back. Watch your hands, where your hands are. Yeah. Okay, there, perfect. That's enough. Yeah. And when I say push her down, I don't mean like crush her into the ground. I mean just, hey, let's see. And I would do this thing. I'd go, hey, hey. What are you looking for them to do at that point? Stiffen up. It's all on the list. Look at the list. She's either going to stiffen up, she's going to become compliant, she's going to snap at me. Or she's going to melt under pressure. She's going to be indifferent. This dog's totally indifferent. So, uh, is that a dominant thing right there that you're doing? That's a, that's like this thing? That's very dominant. Pushing her or pushing her down this way? Yeah, it's very dominant. Yeah. So this dog seems to be kind of confused, remains relatively neutral and un unresponsive. Again, this dog doesn't really know how to be a dog. That's what you're looking at here. Okay. Um, second dog we did so I'm gonna go continue and I'm gonna get that dog's picture which I can choose from my photo library now and that was this the blue and white pit wasn't it yes so what was that dog's name I believe it was Jade Jade and the, the A number for Jade Nine nine seven. And now I can put the photo, choose photo, and she's the blue and white pity, right? Yeah. I think I got the wrong picture. Hang on. I think it's that one. Okay, done. Next. Okay, and so during that time, um, I, I would say they were both very. Uh, they're kind of ignored each other. She ignored the other dog, right? She seemed to avoid the other dog during walking or interactions at each and every time, period. I don't think she knows how to play with another dog, period. She seems confused around another dog. See how much faster that is than typing? Mm -hmm. Dog to dog food. She ignored the dog, the treat while the other dog ate. Overall behavior on this dog, this is yours. Uh, friendly, easy to handle, engaging, indifferent to human, but friendly in an aloof manner. Stress, uh, scared or avoidant, extremely stressed during entire assessment. What would you pick? The engaging to human, but aloof. Right. Okay. But I would also say um, is a little stressed or avoidant. And I can check both of those, right? And then when I hit next, I can say here, I think this dog does not know how to be a dog yet, period. I think the dog needs some human engagement, interaction to learn how to be a dog, period would be a nice dog with good structure and good handling, period. Done. And there you are. Another one done. Okay? Okay. Well, that app's going to make it so much faster. Well, that's what I'm saying, because now you're talking into the app. You're not writing down and stuff. And this you can theoretically do. Put the phone down, grab it, da 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 I don't have an iPhone, so you have to email it. Well, you will.